Hi everyone, welcome back to the third episode of Sophia APIs and Modified. Today we are going to learn draggable and drop destination API. So this is what we will be achieving by the end of the tutorial. So here we have a drag option where we can select our task and we can drag it to any view we want. So I'm just dragging it and I'm dropping it to our views. Let's say if our crypto UI work is done, I'm just going to select it and I'm going to drop it to our task done. So let's look at how we can implement drag and drop. To implement drag, here we have three different sections and I have shared this code in my GitHub repo. To make our task draggable, we need to add dot draggable and we need to specify the task like we have individual tasks that needs to be dragged. So this task is of structure task type and it needs to be confirmed by transferable protocol. So let's add transferable. And we also need to add the transferable representation. So here I have confirmed my structure task with protocol transferable and I have added transferable transfer representation. Now after adding draggable to the task, we can drag our task but the drop destination is still unknown. So in order to add drop destination, we have a drop destination API. So let's add that. So here so the drop destination API will be added to the scroll view because we are we will be hovering over the section and once we are going to leave drop it it's going to append our structure array so now let's add drop destination so now here i have added drop destination and here we have a drop task now this drop task is a task that is going to be dropped on the section or the view like we have task to do task in progress and task done now we need to check few things we need to remove it from other arrays plus we need to append it into the current array like so let's say if i'm moving task from task to do to task in progress we are going to remove it from task to do and we are going to add it in task in progress in order to get the complete code with animation you can check the github repo link in the description below thank you so much for watching stay tuned for more apis and modifiers